Well, what's going on, YouTube? Your boy Joel, aka Mr. Just Right One, is damn sure checking back in with you today. How the hell are y'all doing? 2018 is upon us. Yes, it is. It's here. It's here. And right now, I'm going to show you a quick peek. First impressions of the RTA of the year. Wait. RTA of the year? Yeah, I said it. It's RTA of the year. Best RTA of 2018. It's there. <laughs> How you like them apples? The Bravo. This was brought to you by a collaboration between Wodofo and a designer by the name of Aaron Hart. Aaron Hart. Bravo. I'm noticing a trend right now in the industry, and I'm actually really, really, really enjoying this trend. The gentleman by the name of Ten Tenacious Texas. Y'all know him. We do vape stew on Fridays with Demo Vapes and Daily Vape TV. Designed the Lucid. And his YouTube following was only about five, seven, six hundred, five hundred, something like that at the time. It's blown up since then. But with that, it goes against everything known in marketing. Pair up with a big YouTube reviewer, make a product, and get people to buy it. The Lucid went against the grain on that. The Bravo does the same thing. And I'm liking what I'm seeing. It's showing you that when you have a design or a concept or a mindset to do something, it's achievable and you can do it. You just got to stay persistent and it has to be a, you can't just design anything and say it's going to work, but if it's something you're passionate about and something you enjoy doing, then yes, it's going to go to market and people are going to be happy with it. While Aaron designed this for to be something that he enjoyed vaping, same thing Tenacious, Tenacious Texas did with his, Lucid, something he enjoyed vaping. While Aaron done that with the Bravo here, he also did something else. I believe he cracked the code for an RTA vape that vapes like an RDA. Does that make any sense? That's something very hard to find. I hear it time and time again. Oh, it's the best RDA vape like you'll experience you'll get. Uh, selling wolf tickets. Until I seen this one and had it in my hand and was able to build it and try it. It's got a very unique build deck. It's like a floating build deck, kind of like the Goonish style build deck with the clamp systems, but instead of being on top, they're upside down. So when you back the screws off, the clamps fall instead of trying to have to wiggle your wire in there. Very, very, very smart. Smart, smart. <laughs> Comes with a bubble tank and a regular tank as well. Really fancy drip tip, really nice colors. But man, that's, yes, it's just a little quick peek on it. But the vape you get off of this is out of this world. Let me just give it a pull. I've, I've built it, filled it up with juice, vaped it a few minutes, poured the juice out, took it apart, and looked at it and said, how in the hell did he do it? Very, very flavorful. You're not just getting a large, massive vapor production. The flavor is there with it as well. You hear me licking my chops? Because the flavor is there. That is on point. I know exactly what that's supposed to taste like, and it tastes exactly like it's supposed to. Do you know why squonking is such a big craze and big phase right now? Because everybody likes that RDA style vape. Not everybody, but most people like the RDA style vape. But they don't like having to drip and drip and drip and drip. So they can just squeeze the bottom, bottom feeds up, and they get that juice capacity they're looking for. Well, you get the same in the Bravo. You get a larger tank, larger juice capacity, but the wicking on it is almost foolproof. And I've had no leaking issues at all. The knurling on it makes for easy to open the top juice fill to break the bottom section off. I mean, take the bottom section off. Works phenomenally. I got the stock drip tip on here, but I did have a dock drip tip on there just because I wanted to see what it looked like, the knurling and knurling. To me, I think this was designed for the dock tip. With the knurling that's on it, with the matching of the knurling of the dock tip, I don't care if it's imitation or not, man. It works. Oh, I like it a lot. Rumor has it I have a few coming my way. And what I'm going to do now, since this is just a little quick, quick, quick peek. If 
you want to earn early entries into getting yourself one, start using that hashtag Bravo RTA. Hashtag Bravo RTA. Do that all over Waterfalls page. Do that all over Facebook. Let's get the people hyped on this one, guys, because I believe this product right here, the Bravo RTA by Waterfall and Aaron Hart, is going to be the game changer. It's a game changer we've been waiting for. And what better way to start off the year than 2018 with a game changing RTA? And yet, yeah, there's going to be the naysayers out there that want to say what they want to say about it. Guys, truth be told, I did talk to Aaron about this project. I've known about this project for a very long time, but I have no monetary gain or benefits in this matter, none whatsoever, nor do I have any monetary gains or benefits in any other vape-related market. It, it's just not there. So therefore, my opinion that I give you is my wholehearted opinion. If it was bad, I'd tell you it was bad. If it's good, I'm going to tell you it's good. This is a damn good product. I'm very, very impressed with it. I am going to spend some more time with it. I will give you a full review of it here coming very quickly. Also, the Arc Mod giveaway is still up. Go watch the last video to learn, earn your entries in that as well. Mercy. Yes. Congratulations, Mr. Aaron Hart and Wodofo. Y'all have done something phenomenal here. Cannot wait to see what other people think about it. I will be back to give you my full opinion on this matter. I just wanted to shoot a real brief, quick video kind of showing it to you a little bit, letting you know what I think about it on first impressions. Wodafoe's nailed it. I'm happy for them. I'm glad. I've always been a big supporter of Wodafoe and the Wodafoe brand. Uh, Aaron Hart, big supporter of him. The Bravo movement, you know, I'm really a, a big fan of that. A little insight to the Bravo. The Bravo is, is his mindset. He's like me. He has a lot of respect for the veterans out there. And he, he said himself, if he can get one more vapor to stop, one more veteran to stop smoking and start vaping, then he's good. He's happy with it. The Bravo name on it, the quality of vape you get out of it, I think he is on to something. Y'all definitely stay tuned. Remember, if you want to earn early entries to the few that I got coming to me, I might do a little giveaway on them. Yeah, you already know that. Come on, man. It's Joel, Mr. Just Right One. I'm going to do a giveaway. So uh, if you want to earn early entries into that, because again, on the, art, the review video, there'll be giveaway on it as well. Go ahead and start using that hashtag Bravo RTA. That is hashtag B-R-A-V-O-R-T-A. Hashtag Bravo RTA. Let's get that across the net. Let's make some noise. Guys, I don't know when the release date is of this yet. I'm not very sure. I would, this wasn't teased like normal products have been teased. It wasn't hyped like normal products have been hyped of sorts. It doesn't need the hype. It didn't need the tease because when they delivered, they delivered a solid product. Your boy, Joel, AKA Mr. Just Right One, checking in and checking out at the same damn time. Remember, I absolutely love you. And I'm going to say it again and again and again until you absolutely know I mean exactly what the hell I say when I say it. If at any given point in time you've ever felt like you are not a somebody, I want you to know you are a somebody in somebody's eyes and that somebody is me. I absolutely love y'all. Y'all be good. Stay blessed.